Who remembers old Western movies, the old cowboy movies? Love, love old cowboy movies, right? So in the old cowboy movies, this was the block. He's the big haymaker, and you go, ha! Right? And then they go, ka-ding, and they just nail the guy, right? Every single time, you saw the high block coming, you saw the big roundhouse punch coming, because the guy threw the big punch here, and you kind of, he threw the big punch, kind of this way, right? Essentially, that's kind of the reality of the things. He throws a jab, and I stun him. And this one is kind of coming after the fact, and I pick it up, and I drive my shot in close. Does that make sense? So you guys are trying to make it like, oh, this is like some advanced super stuff, man. It's a cowboy punch, cowboy defense. He throws one, I hit him here. He throws two, I hit him here, right? I just pick it up. Now, there's nothing wrong with doing something slightly different. He throws the one, I hit him here. He throws the two, and I move to here. Now I can hit this one, kind of a half up a cut, half hook. I hit him to the body here, right? However I want to do. I can also... I make my move to here, and I drop, right? I can now hit him over the left and the right, okay? The bottom line is you moved off the angle. If we are on the railroad tracks, and the first punch is coming here, I slightly move, right? You still think that I'm kind of in this area. He throws the second punch, and I'm under here. Now I've got this one, and then this one to follow. We're gonna do a small duck, with the hands up on our counter. He comes in, I move. Left. She's a nice left hook. Right. Okay? He throws jab. One, two, three. So if you look at it like this, it's a true hook. If you look at it like this, he punches, and I move under. It's now almost a left cross, but it could still be a hook. It's legit either way, get over the arm. Get under it with your head, he goes one, two, right, three, four. But you gotta get off the angle, okay? Give it a try. 